Hello everyone, welcome to UI Brains and this is Naveen. Uh, in this video, we are going to discuss about uh, two HTML tags which is used to display uh, a gallery image. So here we're going to use two tags. One is figure and fig caption. So these two tags introduced from HTML5 version. So let's see how the tag can be written and how to apply the styles and how to display a particular image gallery on the page. So let's have a look. Uh, the tag names are okay. So the tag names will be figure and fig caption. So these two tags we are going to discuss in this class. So figure and fig caption. So how to write? I mean, how to display a particular uh, gallery? kind of image using these tags. So I'll just tell you the structure of uh, these tags now. See, suppose if you want to display the image like uh, a box like this and inside I'm going to display an image and then for this image I'm going to write a caption like this. So if you want to display image. So here uh, the outside box is with the tag called uh, one second the outside the black color tag is called as figure I mean you have to create the first uh, figure elements and then uh, this is your image tag and after that this is a fig caption okay so we have three specific tags to display an image like a uh, looks like image gallery okay so this is what a structure and let's start with the HTML coding to make image gallery using these tags. So I have open WebStorm. So here I create a new HTML file. So uh, right click on this new HTML. So 16 underscore HTML file underscore uh, figure and fig caption. Okay. Yes, it's created and let me change the title. So title is uh, HTML phi figure and fig caption. Fig caption, let's save it. Yeah. So it is like this. Uh, now uh, let me open this in the live server so i just start live server line minus server space minus minus port 9000 okay yeah it's starting okay so let me open the file okay so here i write first uh first image let's say image one so here we have figure and inside you'll be having an image src uh, i have to give the image folder slash image one dot jpg and just give the alt nothing and then you have to give the the caption so the caption of image is just give image one okay so this is what a structure as i display here same structure for figure element inside image and fig caption. So now save it and just see in the browser, it looks like this. Okay, you have an image and it's a caption. So let's convert this like a proper image gallery. I mean the border, box shadow and something you can apply. Okay, so let me uh, write a styles. I'll go with the body tag. I'll say uh, one family. Um, Arial and sans serif. Okay, so here uh, figure. Let me give some nice border. So just say border some five pixels and solid and uh, some red color. Uh, we will change in a moment. Yeah. See, if I say border, it occupy the complete width of the browser. So I have to reduce the width of the border. So how to reduce width? some 300 pixels now check width has been reduced 
but the problem is the image is still outside of your box if you want to fit this inside of this uh, uh, the border you can just give the figure space image you can just give with the 100 percentage it fits inside or else you can give the same width as the parent it still fits or else you can give inherits same as the parent same okay so i'll just go with the uh, 100 percentage fine and then uh, see the fig caption is left side i want to keep it center so i'll say text align center fine and then i have to give some space around that's the padding so here i'll say padding five pixels they get some padding and let's make slight rounded corners uh, but i don't like this uh, border we'll remove it in a moment let's make border radius five pixels or oh, 10 pixels fine see border radius has come but uh, image is not rounded let's make for uh, image border radius uh, 10 pixels again yes it's rounded and after that uh, any styles for yeah the fig caption let me add some styles so how to give figure space fig caption because the child element uh, i'll just give them combination of colors i'll go with background linear gradient 45 degrees and uh, some dark slate gray color dark slate gray color as well as uh, some orange red color okay it's like this and then let me give some space inside there's a padding i'll say padding some 12 or 10 pixels and let me change the color i'll say color color white okay let me give some rounded corners as well border radius at least 10 pixels yep so looks good i don't like this border let me give some nice background color for the whole uh, figure elements so for figure i'll say the background color light salmon some color you get some background color and i don't need this border so i'll just remove the border okay so it looks like this and this is what uh, gallery image and i think i have zoom it yeah so here uh, you can even give some nice background color for the whole body tag i go to body tag background color uh, dark slate gray yes you get some nice image with a gallery fine and i want multiple images like this so what i do i'll just copy this figure and paste image 2 and think it is image 2.jpg and it's image 2 okay you got one and let's make the third one 3 and it's 3 and image 3.jpg yes so lastly one more uh, image 4 and this is image 4.jpg and this is image 4 yes i got all the four images but i don't need the images to be one by one i want to display them side by side so you want to display them side by side you have to go to the figure and you say display inline block in a same line as boxes just check yes it displays side by side but one problem is uh, the full of margin see it's having a lot of margin let me reduce the margin so what i do i'll just say margin some five pixels yes if i reduce the margin is all fit together but only one more problem is see this image okay but this image is less height than the other okay so let me reduce the i mean let me increase or make all uniform height so what you do see the image i say hide also some 200 pixels yes see exactly same height width and same height like this okay looks good and one last thing i want see here left space and here more space you want to keep everything in a center uh, you can do to the body tag one way text align center 
is comes everything center or else you take everything in one say one division and keep it text center okay so now at least it's working and then i want multiple rows so what simply i do i simply copy all the figures copy that and paste and paste so let's say you have full of images okay so this is about uh, i mean uh, figure and fig caption let's make nicely uh, hover effects let's make a hover on each uh, figure so i'll just do do one thing go to figure so figure colon hover figure colon hover let's make some box shadow 0 0 some 10 pixels and the black so let's say oh black is not visible let's make something orange red color so let's try oh that is also not visible let's make white now check yes fine and you can do one thing you can make the background as black complete okay see now you have a hover effect for all the images fine so that's it this is about uh, html5 figure and fig caption with added series styles okay so that's it so please practice on this and thank you so much for watching and we'll see the next video uh, for the next html tags thank you mm -hmm.